All right, if you know anything about New Orleans, you know we'll take any reason at all to have a party. And nothing shows that more than festival season here in the spring. Right now we're at, well, we're at a dual festival right now. We're at the Treme Creole Gumbo Festival and the Congo Square Rhythm Festival. Hopefully you can hear that off in the distance. And uh, we've visited several others today and we're gonna wrap them up. Not only talk about today, the beginning of spring and all the festivals we have coming for the rest of the festival season. So first up is fish stock. This is celebrating Blackman's Parish's natural resources and abundant marine life. This is the first time they held this festival. And we spent a little time there because uh, it's close to where we live. And it was very interesting uh, to see some of the displays and items that they had, some good music on site. This was such a big day. And you'll hear us talk about some of the other places we went. Uh, and it was uh, a filled with things like the Ferret Street Festival, which we didn't uh, get as much video from, but it's an art and music festival with over 200 local vendors. Next up you'll see is here at the Treme Creole Gumbo Festival. This is also in combination with the Congo Square Rhythm Festival, combining both these amazing things. They sit right on the outskirts of the French Quarter in the Treme, celebrating the neighborhood as a key pr proving ground in the birthplace of jazz. It was a lot of fun, uh, but we definitely know we're getting in the summer. While you're looking at some of the uh, video from that, let me tell you about a few other things going on. In April, you have the amazing French Quarter Fest on the 13th through the 16th. We'll probably do a video from there. The Strawberry Fest in Ponchatoula, 14th through 16th. The Tomato Festival in Chalmette, the 21 through the 23rd. The Cajun Fest which will be the 21 through the 23rd. Tulane Crawfish Fest, the 22nd of April. Plaquemine Seafood Fest in Bell Chase, 28th through the 30th. The Italian Fest in Tickfall, 28th through the 30th. And then we begin the big boy, the Jazz and Heritage Festival, the first weekend, which will be the 28th to the 30th of April. You'll also have the Denham Springs Antique Village Spring Festival on the 29th. Art Market New Orleans at Harmony Park on the 29th and Covington Antique and Unique Festival 29th and 30th. That's all just in April. I know that's hard to believe but that's just in April. You'll notice on some of these videos uh, you'll see us hit the 47th annual Louisiana Crawfish Festival. This is uh, something that I grew up going to all my life. It started in 75. Uh, and uh, it's been in St. Bernard Parish. It's this amazing festival celebrating the crawfish, which we uh, all love so much. In May, you have the second weekend of the Jazz and Heritage Festival. That'll be the 4th through the 7th. You'll also have the Thib Thibodeau's Fireman's Fair on the 4th and the 7th, 4th through the 7th. On the 13th, you'll have the Art Market New Orleans in City Park. On the 13th, you'll have the Asian Pacific American Heritage Fest at the French Market. That's not one I've ever made. We definitely want to make plans to try and see that. A great one on Bayou St. John is Bayou Boogaloo, the 19th through the 21st, where you can listen to great music, have great food, and enjoy Bayou St. John. And in that same area, on the 26th through the 28th, at the end of Bayou St. John, is Greek Fest. What a blast that is. The 26th through the 29th of May will be Memorial Day Swamp Pop Music Festival in Hammond. In June, we have New Orleans Food and Wine Experience, 7th through 11th, mostly in the French Quarter, but all across the city. Starting on the 29th of June, running to July 3rd, will be the Essence Music Festival. Like I said earlier, we will find any reason to have a festival. This is but a small percentage of what's going on. These were the top ones that I could find in the local area. Any weekend, they've got multiple festivals, and most of these are free to go to. You can listen to music uh, and, and, and just enjoy the culture and people of the areas around you. We think it's a great idea to get out there. Uh, we'll put a list of all these festivals and links to others in the comments below. And if you get a chance, make sure you uh, check out some of these and let us know what you think.
Well, I hope you've enjoyed a look at some of the festivals we went to today and a bunch of the festivals coming up as the spring continues. We're gonna get ready and go back, finish listening to the music here at the Congo Rhythm Festival. Pretty awesome. We've had our gumbo at the Gumbo Fest. We've had crawfish at the Crawfish Fest. I'm getting a little full, but we're enjoying it all. What should we do next? You'll need to let us know. What do you think we need to see as part of this whirlwind tour of the city in New Orleans? Make sure you go check us out at all the social media sites. Subscribe to the channel here on YouTube, and thanks for being part of our Big Easy Life.